that when you're exposed to different things. Okay. But when you when you have limited resources, then you know you, you don't know you know you, you don't know how to balance that thing. You know okay. what I mean? And so you direct it in, in ways that are, are really inappropriate. Sure. And you don't know what to do with all of that that you've got inside. You know, the, sure. the anger, the, you know, not knowing the answers to some questions, you sure. know, and, and sometimes some very simple questions like, you know what? Why is this happening to me? And is this okay? Well, no, it's not okay for somebody to physically touch you and touch your body when you're five or six years old. Right. You know, but um, if you know if you grow up around a certain environment, unfortunately, it, it, it's all about the mindset. You know, right. and if you don't, if you have limited resources, like unfortunately some of us, you know, have, then you know you're not, you're just not gonna know what to do with all that you're feeling, and sure. you know redirect it or get some help. Sure. Um, find other things to help you to have a you know more healthier, balanced life. Okay. And so you know you start making the wrong choices, right. and you know you yeah. start doing the wrong things, and yeah. you know listening to you know you know that devil in your head that tells you that you can't. Right. And you won't, and you'll never be. And right, you know, yeah, yeah. I, I, you know, in the film. It, so it, while she's smart, right, and and or and seems very strong, yeah, um, she just didn't know how to how to use how it to, in a good way. You right. know what I mean? And so it, it ended up really, you know, right. And sometimes the circumstances have just brought about this huge emotional disconnect from yeah. from multiple factions, exactly. and it was all it was all family. So in my mind, it's kind of like everybody's just one source. And then the body was just so fragmented yeah. because of, of collective, you know, abuse concentrated in certain areas. Yeah. And I think uh, the collateral damage to your character, vicious circle. just a vicious cycle. Yeah. And, and I think so in terms of when you step back from the film now, Josie, and you look at just let's say the black experience as a whole, yes. uh, uh, being a black woman and knowing that this is just one story, right? right. How meaningful was it for you walking away from this, knowing that this is touching so many different black families across our nation? I mean, well, for me personally, and just, you know, you know, talking real talk. Right. I mean, it's so much about giving back. You know, it's okay. so much about the message. Yes. I don't mind working on any project. I don't mind working on any particular character as long as there is a message at the end of the day and go. that's really important to me okay and so while I thought she created all these really dysfunctional characters and they're so dark and, and you just you you bleed for them I mean literally you're bleeding for right. them um, I knew at the end of the day she was telling a story and there was a light at the end of the Beautiful. rainbow and and that's important to me in the type yeah. of work that I'm involved with.